Hello everybody, Let's, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Bros. 3. Now today we are going to be going through World 8. Bowser Land! Oh my gosh! Let's get this started with 37 lives in World 8! Now, what you want to do first is just bypass- Well, just get through these stages, alright? That's the first key. You ain't gonna get nowhere. And if you don't like slow moving stages, well, you might as well stop now. Unless you want to see the awesome end ending. Alright, so let's get started. And we got the slow moving stages. With the bow or ship music, airship. Ah! I ran right into that too. Wow, it's really a battlefield here too. With fire and these little bombs coming out. Uh, I hope I don't die. Please don't let me die! It's too early for Mario to die. We came this far and it's too late to turn back. Come on, we went through every single world. At least I didn't take the shortcut way. I could have ended this game in one episode. Actually, with all Mario games, you can end it with one episode. It only takes a couple minutes and think about it. You just, if you know, memorize all the secrets, then you should be fine. Alright, yeah, get out of here. Um, try not to pick them up, too. Unless you want to pick them up. It's your choice. Yeah, explode on them. Whoop. Didn't see that coming. Ah, great. Come on! Jeez, that's not even cool! Now, if you lost to this boomerang bro, then you're sad. Alright. And we get a star. Of course we're gonna get a cheesy prize. Alright, let's go to the ship. Now, be careful. It's the same thing. I should have never went back there. As I was saying, it's the same thing as the last stage, but except you're on water and everything's just shooting at you like there's no tomorrow. Like, they really try Wow, that was close. They really tried so hard to kill us, like, really. Like, poor, I feel sorry for Mario right now. He has to go through this torture just to save his princess. Like, why does Princess Peach have to get kidnapped and then have make Mario go through all this trouble? Like, he's so... He's doing this out of his kind heart because he loves his princess, but yet, Bowser's just like dominating him. I find this one to be the most favorite Mario games of my all-time favorite, like, never gets old, I don't know why, but yet, this is so cool, that's the first time it's- oh my goodness, I hate this stage. It's the first time it has- Introduced power-ups, um, like, like, mad crazy, like, new ones too, and that's why I like it so much, and plus it's cool. And plus the music is really catchy too, so, don't forget about that part. Alright, come on. I probably will be playing the Super Nintendo version of this. On the Mario All-Stars. So, if you guys want to see that, be prepared. You can have fun, you can watch it, and enjoy yourselves. Grab yourself a soda, grab yourself some popcorn, and watch the colorful graphics of the 16-bit animation of Super Mario Bros. 3 and the Super Nintendo version. Well, I have that. Currently, as owned as the real cartridge. And I'm still keeping it until today. Because, well, I'd still play it sometimes on Super Nintendo. Like, never gets old. Now, this stage will move a little bit faster in Kylie Manor. Like, I'm getting bored of what to say here for this stage. Like, you know. Wow! Look at that! Are you? Oh my goodness, this is not even. Alright. This is like the third death we've been through already? I'll meet you guys at the pipe. Okay, we're finally at the white pipe. Um, yeah. Now, as you can see in the corner of your right, there's a little off glitch up of the bomb pipe whatever you want to call it, and part of the ship. It's not going to shoot you, so don't worry. Um, now we're just going to take this guy out. There we go. Okay. I'm glad they brought those enemies back in the new Super Mario Bros. U, too, as well. So, that made things a lot more interesting. Now, for this part, what you want to do is, well, just slide your way across. Like, there's only three stages, plus the ship, so that's four. And what you do with those weird hypnosis thingies is you can get lucky or you can get unlucky. And especially if you're low on lives, then you may very get unlucky for the very moment and it might just take your death away. Okay, so what you want to do is... Like, just slide across, and if you get lucky, 
no hand will come up. And if you get very un unlucky, then the hand will come up, and it probably will look something like this. Come on! There we go. Yeah, the random anonymous hand. Uh, come on! Does every stage I go through have to have a death in there? Like, is there any... Is there any respect for the man, like, anymore? Yeah, alright. At least I know where the mushroom is. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I ain't trying to deal with that thing. And everyone contains a raccoon's feather, so... You'll have plenty of those. Yay! Alright, let's put this on my butt. And we're gonna eat another star. Okay, let's get it on. There we go. Okay, let's get this treasure chest, and we get another leaf, or a raccoon's tail. Yay! And it doesn't want to grab us by our weird pelvis area. Um... Ah! Come on! That's not even right! Oh, I don't understand the cheap cheats, man. Those cheap cheats, cheap cheats are annoying! Alright, now let's grab the last leaf. Alright. Okay. Wow, I just went into that ship without you explaining it. Well, I will explain it. Well, as you can see, it's moving pretty fast as any other ordinary um, airship in all the other worlds. And you can do this by doing this two ways. You can either use the P-Wing or you can either take the hard way like I'm doing. Now, the P-Wing just lets you fly in the air and you don't have to deal with all this bull crap right here. So, but yeah, I'm on ground and I'm hopping from every platform to platform and I'm doing all the crap that they're throwing at us and trying to avoid all the flames. Yes, that's what I'm doing. And this can get very annoying at the moment sometimes. Alright, whoa, alright, that was close. And we made it! Yay! We made it! And, and we gotta fight that weird guy again. Which I better not die by him or else I will feel really sad. Alright. We got him. Now let's enter the world of darkness! Everybody likes darkness, don't they? Okay. Uh, now, stage one, the official stage one of World 8. How awesome is that? Now, yet, I'm going to be going to a secret pipe right here. Alright, let's get our three one-ups. Alright, there we go. There's our three one-ups. And now, let's just get out of here. Whoa, whoa, hey now, come on. There we go. Ooh, that was close. Alright, then we get a mushroom card. Nice. Alright, now let's go to stage two. Now, there's two ways you can do this. You can take the secret way and get the raccoon's tail or mushroom, or whatever you want to call it. Yeah, raccoon's tail or mushroom. Or, you can either go to a world full of pipes. Um, well, not a world, but a pipe full of coins, I meant to say. Alright, but we're gonna go to the way where there's a lot of coins, and we can just drop down, anonymously, and like, Yeah, that thing. Alright, now let's finish the stage up by just running through it and avoiding all the product plants and all the other crap that they got to throw at us. And please don't let me die. Thank you! <coughs> Alright, we get a star card. Alright, now if you go on this pipe, it's gonna lead you out to this pipe. So, don't even waste your, waste your time going through that pipe. It's just a pipe that sits there and just minds its own business. I don't know why it's there, but, uh, I don't know. 
it's probably going to think users are getting somewhere and probably going to see the other half of the end of the world. But no, you're not. And this tower is kind of tricky. I think there's two of these bad boys in World 8, but I'm not worried about it. Okay. I don't know what's the point of having this. Wow, I just missed it. Thank you so much. Whoa. What? Wow, I let go of the trigger. Okay. Uh, oh boy. Now I'm kind of confused now. There we go. There we go. Um, we want to go to this door right here. Now, you can just wait for it. And yeah, well, unless you're small, you just want to walk right under there. All right, now we're battling on a conveyor belt. All right, there we go. We beat him on a conveyor belt. All right, destroy the castle. And this, okay, I know what's happening. This pipe will lead you to the other way towards where the hypnosis circles are. And this way will lead you into the final area. All right, it should be, I think so. Okay, I was wrong. Oh boy, that was a big screw up right there. Okay. Wow, another tank already. That's nice. And Bowser's Castle. All right, let's go to this to this battlefield of awesomeness of saying we're close to the princess, where everything comes hardcore and everything wants to come at us at once, which is very nice for Mario's opening warm welcome to Bowser's territory. But hey, wow, let's <laughs> get hit by that thing. Come on, we're almost there. Come on, we're almost there. We're almost through. Just a little more. Oh my gosh, there's too many of these things! Oh, we're gonna be hearing this all continue. Oh, yeah, I just tossed that bomb. Thank goodness, I don't wanna get blown up by that thing. Okay. Alright. I'll be right back. Okay! Let's do this! And figures. Uh, of course. They wouldn't put a boomerang bro in there. That would be too easy for Mario. And I bet that one flies. Alright. Princess Peach, here we are. Uh, should I put on one of my awesome looking suits? Sure, why not? Alright. Yeah. That thing. <laughs> Alright, I could take the cheapskate move out to get through the wall, but I'm not going to. I'm going to take the long way. Yes, the long way. To avoid all this madness right here. There we go. There's one up right there. Whoa, I did not see that coming. I totally forgot about those extremely high fireballs that be coming way up in the air like wow that's very nice whoa that was nice hate those trick lasers ah! Ah, stupid punk now I've gotta fight Bowser with my mushroom power yeah that thing yeah here it is it's Bowser what you want to do is just let him plow through the floor and avoid his fireballs, which will be the easiest thing, because his other helpers are much harder than are much harder than he is. I, I really seriously they are. they they have more of a challenge than he does. All he does is spit fireballs and then comes slamming in the air and you just dodge like really, I don't know. But it's still a good game. Come on, that was a total troll move. There we go. Come on. There we go. 
Okay, come on. Well, there he is. He's gone. That thing. <laughs> that funny sound, too. Alright, let's go. Yeah, the room turns pink and Mario has once again saved the Mushroom Kingdom. Thank you, but our princess is in another castle. Hee hee hee, just kidding. Yeah, you better be kidding. Uh oh. Bye bye, huh? Oh, what's happening behind those curtains, huh? This is like that Zelda 2 ending when Link and Zelda was behind those curtains. Eh, I wonder if they're doing that doo-doo thingy. Whatever. Alright, Desert Land, World 2. Yay. World 3! Waterland! My favorite! World 4! Giant Land! Yeah, you better swim, Mario! We hate that fish! World 5! Skyland! Yay, my favorite too! One of them. Because you can pose like that. World 6! Iceland! World 7! Pipeland! Yeah, the most one of the most hated worlds ever. Yeah, World 8! Darkland? Oh, okay, I guess I was wrong about Bowserland. Well, Darkland, alright then. Alright, do we get World 9? Star World? No, we don't. Alright, the end. And it starts all over again. Yeah, that thing. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Uh, yeah, go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And that's all. See ya.